Hello. We are back. <laughs> Hi. Yes. You always do these intros and you say hello, and I never know if you're waiting for me to say hello or if you're just doing a dramatic pause to the entrance of these videos. Now, now I was actually expecting you to come with a hello after oh, my, okay. my, my big well, pause. You know, you kind of confuse me sometimes. I, I get that. It's okay. We'll, we, we, we get it next time. Hi. <laughs> Hi, people. Welcome back to Mythos. It's been a month since last uh, video, as mm -hmm. it has started to sort of, sort of be in a pattern now, which is. <laughs> We're not even doing it on purpose. It just keeps <laughs> happening, nor it's like a month apart. Yeah. Um, and this video, this time around, we're not really adding animals. We're just um, adding some um, beautiful structures. Yes, like we said that we wanted to have this nice like sort of a bizarre looking kind of vibe maybe here and some more buildings houses uh, close to the nile that goes up towards the um the hippos uh so that's kind of like just uh, what i'm um, what i'm doing in uh, in today's video um it's a short one since this is literally what i'm doing today um but it is also kind of nice because um we're using a lot of the new pieces from the new pack uh which yeah. Which you guys will uh, see slowly being added. Uh, we will also talk a little bit about. It. You also got a chance to go in uh, Sparkle and uh, and add your own. Yeah, I sort added of... a little bit of. Yeah, it wasn't like a crazy amount of stuff, but because um, I want to get more of the like you said, the marketplace kind of established before I go putting in a bunch of foliage and um, clutter pieces and stuff like that. Yes. Just because I don't want to put something down that is going to have to be moved or deleted anyway. So, you know, I, I just kind of want to wait for the ma majority of the structure to be up before before we go crazy with the fun, extra fun stuff. Yeah. Tiny detail bits. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, yeah I was that. able to put a little bit of like foliage here and there that you'll see in a little bit. Yeah, because the first time, first part of the video here is just uh, me just trying to figure out uh, a sort of a, like a transition way um where they again go through this sort of arch uh, and i kind of like that we kind of want to have these levels where they go up and down some stairs mm -hmm. and, you know yeah, instead and, of everything just being flat all the time just yes. it creates more interest if you can create some levels and also um, give some depth to to uh like if you look look down uh, as soon as we have uh, some cinematics at the end you'll see what i mean about it then yeah absolutely it's uh I mean, just this building in particular, just the peak of it, like how much it added uh, to to this now area here on the left side of the of the temple. It's really nice. Like I'm, uh, I'm really happy so far for uh, where this is going. Pretty much, like just this entire area. Um, oh yeah, it's definitely bringing the whole space to life. And um, so we have, like, we talked about it before in previous videos, where we have like the pyramids, and it's going to be more of like the um, palacey type vibe and this section over here and then once we finally get to the other side will be more of like the um middle lower class like area but also just more of the common i guess just commons area right where yeah like, majority of people would have lived in yeah vibed i guess yeah exactly so and that that'll be that'll be nice too because we still like because we said on the left side here is going to be more where we maybe will like we'll build a little bit more of the more broken up buildings, like ruined pieces here and there, maybe a fallen uh, obelisk or something somewhere. And uh, and then maybe on the right side, we might go a little bit more, I don't know, maybe more wealthy in, in our yeah, design okay. and architect. Because uh, mm -hmm. as I said, we've yeah, mentioned before, we have that crazy Pinterest uh, folder uh, where we mm -hmm. literally add whenever we just see something that's like, oh, that has potential. Um, we add that in. And uh, so, like, yeah, what and I that's kind of what we did with, the, yeah, that's what you did here with the. Well, they'll see it in just a second. The marketplace type situation, right? Yeah. Um, banners coming over the walkway, and or the what do you call it? Not banners. Uh, well, I guess it's uh, awnings. Yeah, well, like tapestry. Or sunshade co oh. cover. I, yeah. <laughs> I know. <laughs> My brain's not working. Yeah. <laughs> um. But yeah, this, I'm really happy for, for how that turned out, and I struggled a lot with that. But we can we can talk about that when we get there for a bit. But this was um, this was a building uh, we we found in on on our Pinterest that I kind of like just thought I would try to get the base done, and then just sort of adding my own 
like design on it and architecture and stuff like that uh, and it's just like super detailed yeah I, I don't know i just felt like i wanted to go in and try to to make some more detailed stuff and also these things here can we we can duplicate those and add to a little bit of other buildings so we don't have to make these uh make like again, yeah. extension windows or i don't really know what they're called uh, called but uh, it's just nice to have these sort of extra pieces because they are kind of tedious if you constantly have to make them uh, yeah i can see that <laughs> so uh so yeah it was a thing just to i wanted to see how things would turn out and yeah that looks nice yeah really happy for it i used like i don't know i think it was the arctic pieces in that one like the and then someone like from the new pack like my god the new pack is just there's so many pieces and so is that the europe European pack? Yes, that one. It's uh, okay. it is literally one of the best packs they've added into the game, if you ask me. Uh, just these small things I added inside of these two uh, rocks here are legit a piece from that pack. Like it's one single piece that just gives this nice deco piece, um, which is just what I needed here. Um, so, so yeah, it was perfect. Heck yeah. And then I'm um, again it's just trying out a different design of style uh, for the uh, roof top of the buildings here. Um, I thought we could have a little bit of this too. Because uh, it, it kind of in that, uh, so, and since this is sort of more, like I want it to feel like it's... Gate kind of. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Because right. um, uh, on the other side, we're probably just going to add a few more buildings and then just going to be an open space to get a look at the hippos, right? Because this is legit, yeah. probably... Yeah, and we'll have that big gate, the actual like water gate there too. Yes, which is probably going to be the big uh, part of that section there, theme-wise, I would say so. Right. Um, and it will also only be the kind of only spot people will get, get to see the hippos real close. Um, so. Yeah, and it'll be cool. I'm just looking forward to those those angles they're gonna look so cool when yes get it all. with the pyramids in the back and the hippos and we haven't really like played around with the hippo habitat either as far as like um, no we just added them shrubbery and stuff yeah, yeah. we haven't like be sure they could it swim it. yeah yeah that's, that was, that was, that the was a thing that was a pain oh my god we do not speak water. of this yeah, we've complained enough about the water, I think, in this game. Uh, I don't yeah. think in the... Mm, I don't think in the other areas there would be so... Maybe Greek area will have some water. Uh, like, I mean, yeah. animal-wise. Um, that actually lives in, like, like the gators we've had. Flamingos. Right. Uh, hippos now. Uh, I mean, but... And the camels yeah. are just camels, you know. like They're just their own thing. <laughs> <laughs> they um, them. So... Yeah, I, I I just had an idea, and I've kind of like just made like a custom window here. That is so cool. So you just use like little tile pieces? I actually just used the thinnest plank there is and just turned it so I had the smallest, uh, uh, yeah, end of it. Side, yeah. Yeah, side showing. And then I just used them as so it looked like tiles sort of thing, so yeah. So when you're building something like this that we're looking at right now, are you looking at a photo like? Um... Yes, I have. Occasionally, I actually just have my Pinterest folders open where I have small pictures just placed mm -hmm. around, uh, and I kind of like just s sort of steal and like try ideas from each kind of. Uh... And you're just like looking at the shape and then trying to recreate the shape with the pieces that you have. Yeah, like the base, right? And then when it comes right. to detailing and all that stuff, it's sort of like my own game. Like that's where right, right. that's that's where I can come in and be like, okay, how do we make this building pop? You know. Mm -hmm. uh, and when we say this now, and we're, I'm putting the decals on, and these pieces are legit like some of the best pieces they've ever added in these games. Um, yeah, the decals. Yeah, they are amazing. Um, yeah, because Planet Zoo doesn't have like a. Um workshop right where you can upload like you can make your own things and upload it like the mega toolkit no yeah or like the sims you know yeah they don't have that cc that'll probably be whenever they like with planko whenever they stop uh, do more to the game they, they will open it up for the community yeah I so they're that now because then it would probably save them a lot of work <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean, there is mods and stuff you have made mods where they make their own animals and stuff right um, oh that's kind of cool yeah 
Uh, so, so there's there's. Well, I mean that's essentially what CC is, right? It's just mods, like. Sort of, yeah. It yeah. Is. And, but. Yeah, this is cool. Yeah, I was actually really starting to like it, especially after I started to add all the decals on and we started to see the cracked up walls and and just the whole just the whole uh, design of this building. I really like it. I really like it. Yeah, I like it too. It's always nice to like watch you make something from nothing because like my brain does my brain just doesn't work this way. <laughs> I, I told I've said it before like a hundred times. Like I can do the decorating. Like I can do the interior design. I can do the foliage and. You know, color and all. Yeah, you, like, we know you struggle with color, but like, I can do all that. But man, I just, my brain, like, and, and I don't have the, to be honest, I just do not have the patience for this. Like, I'm watching you do this and I'm just like, yeah, nah, I would have fucking given up. Like, I've been like, yeah, nah, probably. Yeah, nah. In my <laughs> yeah, nah, yeah, nah. <laughs> like, for real, like, I would have been like, nope, I'm out. Like, uh, <laughs> I just, I don't have the patience for it. Well, I mean, honestly, when I first started playing these sort of games, I was sitting and like watching others and I was like, I don't even know how these people have the time to do this, right? <laughs> now it's like your job. <laughs> and now, it's, yeah, it's like, I'm just <laughs> sitting here and yeah, I, I'm just building until freaking, I mean, I hope I never get a burnout because I, I really like to be creative, right? And I can show it in this sort of uh, aspect and no so well soon this will all be like vr and you'll be actually creating your own wor worlds that you can like literally walk through and yeah in, so. that'll be lit this is good practice for when that comes yeah be soon i'm sure <laughs> oh i am 100 sure too before oh, yeah. we before we look around you should you should download the unreal engine and, and play around look and see yeah yeah you should it's free pretty sure i don't know if your computer can handle it but we'll see, we'll see. yeah I mean, it seems pretty optimized for what I hear. I mean, yeah, I can the software itself. Look into it. It would be fun to just try to make your own sort of world. That would be that would be something I would love to do. You know? So yeah, that'd be super dope. Um, I mean, I can do that in these games now. Like that's also sort of like why Black Mirror is where Black Mirror is now. You know, it's, mm -hmm. it's more of just a, a park. Um, well, and so, but again, like. I think also what we're doing here, creating this sort of mythologic uh, world of mm -hmm. worlds, I guess. Right. <laughs> <laughs> um, where we want to integrate a lot of the stuff we know from it. And because it's also going to be informative and some parts educational because we're going to add our own billboards and add some small screens that tells a little bit about like, and also maybe try to explain some things around this and that. and. Yeah, you know, just a, uh, it's just gonna be a, a nice experience, and you're gonna be, as I say, get something from from one of some of the coolest mythologies, if you ask me. So. Uh. Yeah, absolutely. <clears throat> Definitely have some information, you know, because some of this and most of this was like these people's religion, right? And it still is around, you know, mm -hmm. around the world. So it'd be really cool to just try to implement some of that. So maybe some people can learn some stuff. Yes. I mean, I've already learned a lot, like just from us on our Pinterest board, and then like looking more into it. And then, oh, like, just and you with the, uh, the architecture and like. Oh yeah. Like what we said last last episode or whatever it was about the domes. Yes, know? I was just about to mention that. Yeah, yeah. yeah so, um, yeah, I'm excited to see like what else we get to learn. It's fun. Mm -hmm, I am. I like uh, this kind of project is like super unique in that aspect. I think. Oh yeah, it's uh, it's fun, and sometimes I get myself down into a little rabbit hole where I just like, oh, this, oh, I didn't know this. Oh, interesting, you know, like yeah, it's going into uh, yeah, it's, this was really fun, especially when it's come to like themes and stuff. You haven't really, it's also a good way of just getting like knowledge about how things work when you have to build stuff. Like, what did they like? What was their main focus when they built this and etc. You know, right. It's, um, it's always cool, and I've definitely got also like better at just researching uh, and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, yeah. So if any of you guys need some kind of like inspiration, try to give yourself a project that is like similar and like you're really putting yourself in in it, you know. And make sure that it's something that you have a, a an interest in or a passion in, right? That you can like, <clears throat> like you said, you know, burnout is a real thing, and I feel like people probably burn out whenever they're creating things that aren't speaking to their interests and their passions and their soul so make sure that you know if you're gonna be building and making things 
don't just do it because you feel like you have to. If you if you want to practice, you want to get better at something, make sure that it's something you enjoy. Exactly. So, yes. Yeah, I'm just... Oh, this looks cool. Yes, as I said, I uh, I was trying just first putting uh, awnings and like uh, carpets hanging from just the top, but you saw I I quick uh, quickly cut that part because I was sitting and I just couldn't figure it out. And then I was just like I said, looking through our Pinterest board, and I found like this sort of section we've had like since the beginning. That was one of the first. Yeah, I was gonna say that was one of the first things I saved to that Pinterest board. Was yes. That that walkthrough of that bazaar. We'll, we'll need to make sure we insert a picture. Um, yes. Or something too. Like maybe some, some inspiration photos start entering them here so people can see what we're getting our inspiration from as well. Yeah, because it is like sometimes like that's just what I need sometimes just to get going. I have to look at something just to get some things into my head and then all of a sudden some days it's just like where I can just go in and then I just build something like that is just in my mind because right yeah and it, it it changes like sometimes you do need to get the inspiration to just keep on going and well yeah uh, and Absolutely. yeah it's just nice and you saw here quick I, I deleted the shops because it was just i wanted to see how it looked with all the counters uh yeah but we are gonna put some counters in here so people actually can buy stuff and then we're gonna try and make right. some some stands some markets bazaar ish sort yeah, of the uh, we'll definitely be playing with the clutter too for sure yeah yeah and so. we can you can see we added some things to that shop right here on the left like signs cracks yes some colors on the watering hole right there to the right i really like this yeah. section here especially with the arch here uh, it goes up mm -hmm. the stairs and um, yeah and we'll add more lighting like the fire and stuff like that as well like two braziers hanging from the walls right there on the other side would be super dope yes it would it would be amazing mm. yeah this and looks so good wax yeah, I really like this. Are those awnings right there, the fabric? Is that from the new pack as well? No, no, they have been in the game for a long time. Oh, those have been in there? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. I've those just never... perfect right there. They, if they are perfect, yeah. And it's only one piece that I just uh, smacked together, so we got three of them, right? Yeah. yeah. But yeah. Oh, oh my god, look at that. It's... It so well. It's... Uh, I really, really like this. And especially also this... Uh, yeah, sort of support system I did where we can have the uh, like the awnings hanging because I was, as I mm -hmm. said, I was struggling trying to figure out a way to just have them hanging from poles and shit because right. it was going to yeah. be a big mess. Uh, I like and, how you just wound, kept it simple with just like those wooden dowels. It's perfect. Yes. Then just uh, look at that. That's so nice. Yes. So uh, so uh, so yeah, this is uh, pretty much uh, the end of, of the video, uh, friends. Awesome. Yeah. So uh, hopefully, you guys. yeah, always. And um, remember um, to check up next month. Maybe we will have a new video. Hopefully. Yeah, yeah, probably at this rate we will. So uh, so yeah, um, stay awesome, guys, and uh, take care. And then we'll see you around. Yeah, thanks for joining us. Bye. Bye bye.